Baik, sementara itu ASEAN kini berada di landasan yang tepat dalam menangani pandemik COVID-19. Meskipun berdepan masalah kekurangan vaksin, logistik serta keengganan orang ramai untuk divaksin. Datuk Sri Syamudin berkata, lebih 65% daripada populasi negara anggota telah mencapai tahap imuniti terhadap COVID-19. I am pleased that we in ASEAN have been working hand in hand sharing best practices and now even coming to mutual understanding to arrange various travel bubbles and travel lanes as vaccination improves over time. Indeed, each country has made our national vaccination rollouts our highest priority. Despite vaccine shortages, logistical and public reluctance to be vaccinated. Almost 90% of the high-risk population in ASEAN has been vaccinated with at least one dose of vaccination. In most ASEAN countries, more than 65% of the population has achieved a level of immunity to COVID-19. Jelasnya negara anggota ASEAN telah bekerjasama berkongsi amalan terbaik dan kini mencapai persefahaman bersama untuk mengurus pelbagai gelembung pelancongan dan laluan perjalanan apabila kadar vaksinasi bertambah baik dari semasa ke semasa.